the announcement to postpone uh, football was extremely disappointing. Witnessing the confusion on our guys' faces when I shared their news of postponement was gut-wrenching. It is my responsibility to help our guys chase their dreams and delivering the news felt like I was doing the opposite. It felt like I was taking away their dream to play at Penn State, even if for some it's only temporary. We as a coaching staff and administration fought as hard as we could to fulfill the desires of our student athletes and their parents to play this fall. While I appreciate the complexities and difficulties of this decision for the leaders of our conference, I'm extremely frustrated because we still have very few answers to communicate to our young men and their families about their futures and very little understanding of the factors contributing to the decisions. I don't necessarily have a issue with the decision, but I have an issue with the process and I got an issue with the timing. You know, it was challenging to keep getting up in front of my team and getting up in front of my parents and not having answers to their questions. So to me, if we were going to make the decision to delay the season, that we at least took the time to work with the NCAA and the Big Ten to have all the answers for what that's going to mean when it comes to eligibility, you know, when it comes to scholarships, you know, when it comes to, you know, the, the next opportunity to play, when that is, is it the spring, is it the winter, is it going to not be to next season? What does that mean with roster management? What does that mean with incoming recruits? Um, you know, I, I've met almost weekly with our players, their parents, and also recruits, and it's difficult to continue getting up in front of those people as the leader of my organization and not only deliver bad news, but not be able to deliver the answers to their questions. I think that's the job of the leader is, is to set the vision, set the plan, and then every, drive everybody towards that vision and that plan. Do I think things are going to change? I don't think we're going to go back to a fall season. I don't, I don't think that that's going to happen. I don't think the petitions and, and the, the voices are going to allow us to go back and say, you know, we're going to play this fall. Uh, I wish that was the case, but, but I don't see that happening. I don't really have an issue with the decision because at the end of the day, we made a decision based on what we thought was in the student athletes best interest from a health and welfare standpoint. And, and let, let's understand everybody, everybody understands the magnitude of this decision. So, so, you know, I, I think in some ways there, there should be, you know, there should be some praise for the decision that was made, you know. Um, but I, I think, as I've stated before, my issue has been the process and the timing of it, not necessarily the actual decision that was made.